Welcome back. Ugh. Look, I was gonna jump up the wall. Is this a river? I guess there was a bridge here, so yeah, it would've been a river. Huh. All the material and stuff kind of just fucked it up, though. We had a nice little pond here, though. Question is, oh, there's the door. I was like, question is, where's the door? Oh, well, I just found it. First responder, huh? God, I hope there's not much radiation in here. Can't take much more. I mean, I can, but uh, I don't want to, because then it's going to be like, oh, I'm going to get tapped once, and there goes my health. Well, something's fucking attacking each other over there. going on? Like a shotgun burst hit the wall there. Up! Oh. Up! Oh. Saw him! There we go! Okay. Don't drink the toxic water! Where am I getting shot from? I gained way too much radiation right there. God damn it all. Where are you guys firing at me from? The hell? I think there's still a ways above me, so... Uh. The fuck? I'm not gonna be killed by a fucking rad roach. I have 41 health at my max. Oh my god. Fuck is that? Super mutant? It's a super mutant leg. I'm guessing there's like a super mutant body underneath this. But uh Is this last motherfucker at? He's right above me right now. This is a glass floor here, so he can't get me. I do not want to go out to Appalachia.
Damn, now it's gotta load the entire fucking world. Then we're gonna have to go back in, do another loading screen. I really hope if I die, I don't lose my mutation, but I think I do. Okay, well, we're outside now. Take a look out here real quick. Oh, thank you, Jesus Christ. I don't think I can get back up there, though. That's a no. That's a big, big fucking no. Um, what about right here? Can I jump up? Nope. I can jump up right here, though, maybe? Oh, okay. We can do this. We can do this. We can't do this! Oh. Someone help! There's no one near me, fuck it. God damn it! That is upsetting. Okay, please tell me I'm still still have my thing. I do! Woo! And we have a little bit more health now, too. Where'd I die? Just up there. Fucking really? Golly. Up there, huh? See if I can get to it. Ooh! Mario Lord soft shell cake. I'll take that. Mmm, don't care about any of that. Oh, hey. Please don't irradiate me further. At least not until I can figure out how to get rid of radiation without losing mutations. Ah, fuck off! Get my knife back. Okay, they gave me back. Nope, they did not give me back. Come on, come on. There's an E button there to give it back. Okay, now there's not. I got it back. Excellent. I get really upset when I can't get my knives back. And they get just, like, wasted like that. I don't know where that guy went, but uh, I'm not gonna complain if he just wants to frolic off. And Oh, look. What? Are you threatening to kill yourself, huh? Gonna jump off the ledge there? Oh no, he jumped! <laughs> uh, shit. Alright, well there's everything. Why am I taking radiation damage here? Why did I pick up the fucking cooking pan? Good question! Oh, I'm taking radiation damage because of that fucking petrified corpse. Why did I pick up the fucking hammer? I don't know! Maybe I'm a little retarded. Maybe I just press E too quickly. Maybe, uh, that ghoul needs to die. Mother fucking son of a bitch hitboxes! Getting a lot of, uh, random ass mods here. 
typewriter. There's just a fucking typewriter in that suitcase? Okay. Moving along, I guess. Oh, I saw a little crate back here. Yeah, there we go. Question, how did this corpse get here? Because I feel like this structure was not here in the beginning. Before the bombs fell. Look, it's scorched. Maybe they were fighting with the uh, barrels. Yeah, what can we cook? Fuck it. And cook some rat roach. Excellent. Just what I wanted. This is where I first came in at, right? Yeah, it's where I first came in at. Okay. What if we go up higher, though? Truly, is there nothing here? What if I go over here? And then go over here? Nope. Okay. I don't there's anything up there anyway, so. Yep, nope. Okay. Nope. At least I have more health now. I mean, that, I guess, the death kind of helped us. And we learned that not all... We learned that uh, deaths don't always make us lose our uh, mutations, which is good. It's always good to learn here. Um, so we know that one fucking scorched boy is up way, way, way top. So let's take our time and just do a clean sweep of the building. Check out everything we can here. I just want to make sure we're all good and dandy here. My work meeting there, I don't know why. <laughs> Nothing cannot be killed. Okay. Can I use the elevator? I can. But I need a key card for that. Okay. Raider corpse. Fucking kidding me. Okay. Do I have rat away? Or rat axe, I mean. Why am I overweight? Huh? Okay, archive messages. Checkpointed. Event. Company memo. Company memo. Okay. I started the mother load. Excellent. Search Penny's office. Did I pick something up that, like, stops me from, like, running now or something? Like, I don't think I picked anything up, did I? Except for these things, but still. cloth or raw rubber. Don't need steel scrap. Don't need a wrench. Wood scrap. Honestly, anything that just has steel in it, I don't need, so go through that real quick, shall we? Don't need molded plastic. Moment, don't need lead. That's got aluminum in it. <laughs> Excuse me, I think I'm good on that. That. Those combination wrenches and the cake pan. 
Bunsen burner, get rid of that. I think I'm good on aluminum at the moment. I'm still overweight, huh? Let's go ahead and screw rid of these. Because scrapping them, I don't learn anything from anyway, so... No harm doing that. I can learn that to reduce a little bit of weight. Okay, seriously, what the fuck is going on with my weight here? Uh... I have negative personality. Is something fucking up my... my strength? Because it shouldn't. I guess I'm just gonna be... Oh, spoiled fruit. Let me get rid of that. Because I'm just kind of confused as to what exactly is causing me to be this fucking overweight. It can't be all these weapons, first of all. I know that these weapons would not cause me to be that overweight. I'm clearly trying to make a joke here, but... Yeah, what? No. I like so few weapons here. Hold on. I guess this fucker's 15 pounds. Let's drop some of those. Alright. Okay. Wait, why? Where are my jumps? The fuck? My jumps are gone. That's not fucking fair. Hold on. Intelligence is one, but I mean, it's supposed to be. Wait, symptoms suppressed? Why are my symptoms suppressed? What? Excuse me? Hold on. Is it the Rad X? Ah, oh, son of a bitch! Okay. That might have been the cause. I open and close the shutters. Hmm. Jeffrey, what do you got for me, my dude? Nothing. Okay. Just stuff I probably already read. Or the characters read, because I didn't read it. Uh, purified water. Take them caps. That's super mutant. Aha! Chemistry workbench. I can scrap my stuff now. So, my hunting rebel is level 5. So my question is, if I keep this and attach the... I guess it would work like that, but fuck, I don't care. Not at the moment. Okay, perfect. That'll work. Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna check if I uh, how, what what it would cost to make Psycho, right? Psycho. It takes digested goo, toxic soot flour. I don't know how to make that. I can get soot flowers, but not toxic soot flowers. And digested goo, huh? Weird. Out of order. 
is just a stairwell. Oh, this fell. Okay. I was like, that's kind of a weird design having it there, right? This looks fancy. Okay, first of all, rude. Can you stop moving your arm like that, please? It's very disconcerting. Go up further with that one. There's the rest of this level here, though. Is this a uh, hiring system? Status. Someone's got all of HR's final. Okay. Oops. Wrong. There we go. Hanover. This is Daniel Hornwright. I presume you've seen to it that the technology support group has updated the senior executive exam with my clarified answers. I'm growing weary of the spineless executives you've been sending me. You find me some candidates with the wherewithal to survive here, or else I'll find someone who will. I was about to damage the holotape too, right? Alright, that one. Never mind. Okay, I guess we're going up. Through this hallway of gore, my god. Okay, we'll search this level next. A lot of just dead super mutants flying around. Put a little bit of light, yeah? Oh, I had to go here anyway. Is that an arrow? Okay. Interact. I got messages. Uh, this one. This one. This one. <sighs> Didn't even matter. Oh, come on. That was a fucking hit, and you know it. I need a little bit more oomph behind my, uh, my axe now. So I think next level, if we, uh, don't get lockpicking as a perk card, we'll increase strength and go for our two-handed damage again. I think that'd be a good, good option. What do y'all think? Y'all think that'd be good? I think it'd be good. Okay, so we gotta go below me to get the, uh, the thing here. What if we go up? That's what I thought. Oh, a short 10mm SMG, huh? That's cool. Alright, looks like there's nothing else here that I can do. Everything's shut and locked and all that fun stuff. So I can go down here, go through here. I 
just check the exam. Begin exam. Let's see. An accident has occurred at one of the company's automated mines, resulting in the deaths of multiple bosses. What's your response? Release a statement promising compensation to family. Blame the incident on aggregators from the local unions. Launch a company-wide safer work program. This one. The one guy said that they wanted to, like, have harsher executives, so... And people with, like, you know, moxie and shit, so I guess we're just gonna take the hardest one. Come to possession of a damaging proprietary information from one of your competitors. What do you do with it? Um... I do this one. Local politician has come to you requesting a sizable campaign donation in return for preferential legislation. How do you respond? Let's see. Dig up dirt on the politician and lower their price. You received threats from a group upset with our automation policy. How do you respond? Give the evidence to the police, allowing them to deal with it, offer them lucrative jobs to get them to reveal their identities, request 24 hour security detail to protect yourself. Hmm. You've been offered a higher paying position at a local regional competitor. What do you do? Turn over the details, a Hornrex top notch competitive intelligence team. Pick a position despite the company's almost superior authority. Leverage your offer to get a higher paying position here. Hmm. Probably this one, though. Process the answers. Ha! Easy. Perfect. And then uh, I think we needed to go all the way down to the bottom, yeah, in order to get the uh, elevator. Take us up there. Boop. Man, I watched some people play this. This is a particular quest. And I must say, this was so much easier than they were making it out to seem. Like they were having all kinds of issues with it and stuff, and couldn't figure out where to go, but literally, it was easy as fuck. Okay. Many of the question answers were like, oh, there's a holotape here about wanting to uh, have someone fierce and whatnot. I guess I'll just answer questions fiercely. Okay, what do we got here? Dispensers? Nothing. Okay. Uh, there's that thing there. Can I, um, attack any of these? I feel like they're gonna come to life at any moment and try to fuck me up. User detected. Connecting. Mm -hmm. User. Connection. Allow more to find the repair beacon, huh? Fuel levels. Okay. Critical. Critical. There's something around here. Repair. Some sort of terminal or something. Huh. Ah, it's a little blown up, but it's here. Uh. MSR, curious Miss Jackson. Direct oversight, power struggles, 
and for Miss Jackson. Okay, that should have given me something. Requisition the repair beacon. Code, blah, 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 blah. Which looks like it's uh, floor below me. Oh no, it's over here. Ah, here. Yeah. Um, three, six, nine, eight, four. Requisition code accepted. Issuing repair beacon. Beacon deployment clearance granted. User, proceed down. Deploy. Eager. Proceed. Elevator. To the opposite. Oh my god. I always forget. I don't know why those are purple now. Ah, what? Oh. Fucking rad roach. I was like, what the fuck? Did the lasers like, shock me or something? Threw me off. <sighs> Sam Blackwell, no, on measure six. Hmm. An estate access card. I'll take that. CEO's terminal. What do we got here? To Governor Evans. Eh, okay. Nothing important there, I don't think. Do 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 going down. I got some drills here. Various sizes. Iron ore. Weird ass hitbox, man. Weird ass hitbox. Hit the E button twice, but it didn't give it to me. God damn it. Okay. Just looking around. I'm out of my own bed. Ooh! Power armor! And it's a T60, which I can't use because I'm fucking not level. Let me guess, 50? No, 40. Oh, I was so close though. Repair the beacon, but what if I don't do that? Also, you might be upset with me for this, but I'm gonna scrap that power armor. Keeping that though. First of all, I can't use it for another like third, no, 25 levels. So it's pointless. Also, scrapping it might give me some information, which I don't think it did. So it was kind of pointless anyway. Still. Evacuator, or excavator suit, final steps. Our efforts in shuttering Garahan's mining excavator suit endeavor are nearly complete, thanks to my team's interventions into the man versus machine competition. Our auto miners are now the talk of the region, while the Garam's stock price is free falling. Now the final step. From everything my advisors tell me, the tech behind the excavator suits is solid. They say their mineral detection technology borders on revolutionary. There's an impressive amount of proprietary technology inside those walls. A hostile takeover of uh, Garahan mining is the savvy move right now. A fleet of automated, nigh indestructible auto miners armed with the capacity to independently seek out material wealth. That's the future, Daniel. That's how we beat AMS at their own game. We just need to be bold enough to do it. 
I would suggest you quickly move on this. Your motherload project will still be there once we establish ourselves as the primary industry concern east of the Rockies. You say the word and I can have the board here within 24 hours to start talking strategy. I would also highly suggest you burn this document as soon as you've read it. Dutch Wharton, Senior Vice President, Corporate Engagement, Hornwright Industries. I'll just go ahead and take that. Okay. I also got some more stuff to scrap, so why the fuck not? A miner hat, clean. I wonder if I can use that to, like, toggle on a light. I don't really care because I have a pit boy but whatever. Okay. Hold on while I scrap this. Okay. Now then. Let us repair this. And get out of the fucking water. What the fuck just happened? Launch detected. Distance 12 meters. The mother load. What did I get? A bunch of garbage, I bet. Get ready at the crafting bench. Black titanium, aluminum, gold, lead, microscope, some other stuff. A missile launcher that I can't use for another couple of levels, so it's getting scrapped. A microscope. The black titanium ore, huh? Learn the history of. Riverside Manor, huh? Okay. Hope we can just go ahead and skedaddle now, so. That was all that was here, I guess. Boop. Back down the lobby with our fucking shitty ass fucking radiation levels. There we go. Match to avoid the damn water. And out we go. Okay. Oakley. Dokely. Chokely. I don't know. More level 17. Yay. A little more and we'll be able to actually start wearing power armor when we find level 20 power armor. Which is like everything. Loading all of Appalachia. Please stand by. Ugh. Okie dokie. Barrels! Got him! This place looks interesting in the rain. I, uh, just remembered something. Hmm. Well. That is unfortunate. This uh, little shack over here, maybe remember. We're gonna take a look at that. I'm gonna go over to there. And 
that'll be my plan for now. Is this a player's base? I don't think it is. Nah, it's definitely not. This stuff wouldn't be here if it was. The owner. I knew the man who lived here. It wasn't long before someone killed him for this house. Sniped from one of the overlooking buildings. Don't let it happen to you. This is a nice little place. I missed? Yeah. If this wasn't here, I would consider taking this place over. Like, I would, uh, I would build something here. Which is a shame. This would be a great place for a fucking... a base, you know? There. Glowy as fuck. I wonder if I just do this and that, can I actually place it down around here? Maybe on this other one? No? That's so dumb. That'd be a great place. Wow, Bethesda. Wow. Way to just ruin my hopes and dreams. Okay. And anyway, we'll go check out this other place here. Mm. I just saw the light and was enticed. Greaser jacket, a swimsuit. Yeah, there was literally nothing right here. Great. Um, a couple other shops here we can look at, though. A little barber shop, it looks like. This would have been a pretty cool little barber shop. This seems awkward. Doesn't it? Like, here, you can get over on the sink and wash the person's hair. But here, you have to be, like, between these? It'll be kind of, like, a weird angle. I don't know. That's just me thinking out loud there, that's all. The music changed so suddenly, I was like, what the fuck? That scared me a little. Okay. Looks like that's everything right here. Is this uh, building right here the medical symbol? Yeah, it's the AVR Medical Center. Okay. Gotcha. Well, I remembered something. And uh, I want to do it before we go any further. Uh, so, we're going over to Camden Park. Because there was a thing we needed to look at. my health so low there? There we go. So if you remember when we actually went here, which has been a while, so I don't blame you if you don't, you may remember we saw something and the, uh, the ramshackle house that was outside of, uh, the, the one building that was on that, the little delta there. Um, it reminded me of it, because it is exactly what it looked like down here. So there was a little underneath this bridge, just like a little, uh... I always miss that fucking first shot! God damn it. Anyway, there was a little, like, uh... Slapped together shack out there, right? Underneath this bridge. And we were going to look at it, I said, after we had, you know, finished uh, taking a look here. Well, I was wrong. We didn't actually look at it. That was a 95% chance on a miss. Wow. Fuck me, I guess, right? Yeah, anyway, it was right down here. Yeah. 
An imported Chinese panda. Huh. Some 10 millimeter rounds, some insta mash. Yeah. That was so worth coming over here. Hell yeah. Y'all hearing that? What is that? Was it a Scorched Believer standing above me or something? It was like someone plucking like the string of like a banjo or something weird like that, right? Anyway. I'm just gonna go ahead and jump over that fucking fence. Come on, 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 come on! Fuck you! I hate when they just jump at you like that. It's so hard to fucking hit them. I guess while we're here, we'll do the, uh, thing. Again, how the fuck did I miss that? How the fuck did I miss that? What? Excuse me? Hello? Piece of shit? What up, Zeke? Fucking is hard work. This here lucky bunker ain't. Give it a go. Oh, hey. You back to giving another go? Well, get Mosey into them cards, Jim. <clears throat> hey there. Got a hacker to explore? The lucky bunker is the game for you. Alrighty then. Better get moving. Fuck me. On the roof! Really? No? Oh my gods. Okay. We're fine. We're safe. They're all just fucking hiding from me now? Oh, fucking hell. Well, I guess we're giving up. P 
piece of shit. Fucking. <sighs> Seriously. I need to find a way to purge my radiation without losing my mutations. Why the fuck are you all? Oh my god. Of course I ran right into all of them. Hey bro, help a brother out. Kill those things. Got one. Got two. Fuckers. There's three. God. Health, please. Damn. Seriously, a cleave would be hella nice. Fuck me. Okay. It was just like last time. Where we had like no time left to finish the rest of them, right? This time I know where all they're at. They're all at, I mean. You. Up. Fuck you guys! I'm not dealing with that. Okay. Oh boy. Fuck! Didn't mean to fall down, son of a bitch. Oof. Whatever. Why are you alive? that one. So you can only do one a day? That seems kind of fucked up. Well, I can make a combat rifle now. Under eight. What's another miscellaneous? Yeah, Mr. Fuzzy Token's twelve. Okay. Well, whatever. Assuming all these assholes are dead. Yep. Thank you. All right. Well, I'm gonna uh, end things here for now. When we come back, uh, we'll we'll go back up here. I think. Take over the AVR Medical Center. 
Then I'll head back down out of here. Uh, before we do that, though, I'm curious. I want to move our camp. I want to see if there's like a nicer, flatter, cooler place for it. There's so many fucking trees and rocks and bushes in this damn game. It's a bit of a pain in the ass to like find a decent place, you know what I'm saying? The place I'm at's good, but it's a rock and I can't really put down uh, plants on rock. So, yeah. Let's just get to the top of this hill. Okay. Random train debris. That's... Oh, fuck. Nothing even around me, right? Level 22, screw that shit. Nope. Oh, look, it's from aluminum. Anyway, bail. Also, I remember, um, I think I remember seeing previously, uh, it was like one of those places where, you know, we put an excavator down in one of those other outside areas. <clears throat> um, that had like phosphorus and stuff on it. It was like just a hole in the ground, right? Ground hole in the ground. But there was no, like, area to claim around it. So I was wondering if I move, like, a camp next to one of those places, if there becomes the possibility to, like, put an excavator down on something like that. I don't know. Maybe I don't remember it clearly and it never happened. But, uh, anyway. I'm gonna end things here. Uh, I'm gonna go back to camp. Put some stuff away. Do some maintenance on stuff, I guess. And then we'll come back and, uh, we'll go from there. So... Until next time, everyone, we'll catch y'all later. Bye now.